What's going on everyone? Boss here again. This time we're here for another One Piece episode. This is One Piece episode 1059. Uh, last time we kind of jumped around a bit. We got a little bit of everybody. Um, we had some focus on King and Zoro kind of continuing that battle. There's, um, there's a few battles still going on. And then we saw Orochi and Komorosaki um, is on the island. Uh, so we see that <laughs> he thought he was in heaven. So <laughs> that was, he's going, he's, he's pretty crazy. So let him think whatever he wants. <laughs> but yeah, without further ado, let's see what this episode has to offer. They're just staring at it though. Like, <laughs> move. <laughs> Here's um, Conjo's voice. You wait to right there to shoot at it? Okay. Oh, uh, going to where you're going. <laughs> I guess they're on for the ride. <laughs> oh, never mind. I would just stay on the ride. I'd be like, yo, take me to wherever. But I guess you can't just go wherever. <laughs> you're just walking through the flames? All right. Y'all on um, Daenerys. They're Targaryens out here. They taking pictures of you? <laughs> Apu just like yo. He's still going. <laughs> this guy's goofy. And Drake is right there too. Oh yeah, I don't know what you thought was about it. Oh his neck. Yeah, that's what you get for doing that though. <laughs> you should have just took your, your picture and left. Dang, bro. See you later, Apu. Yo, he's like, yo. Oh, okay. Yeah, he was. Oh, they know. Oh, he's coming for Drake, too. Oh, Apu ain't done. Then you just gonna sit there and take it? That would've been crazy if I put with a loss and just the one little finger gun. <laughs> oh, now they're working together. Okay, Drake and Apu versus CP0. Oh, he went full, full Rex. Oh! He's about to cut. Oh no, okay. He's just roaring. <laughs> Speaking of roaring. Yeah, he's like he in the bathroom. Or sound like I should say. Oh, back to the plane. He just teared up and frozen in shock. Oh, switching to Zoro. Oh. Yeah, that's right. He was losing his gains. Oh, we back. <laughs> having to fall out. Imagine that, having to fall out with your sword. Back at it. Man, he took a serious wind up. Oh, ooh. Okay, you can just lean back with it. Dang, <laughs> he punched him. His, his fist is so is the size of Zoro. Oh, he getting cocky. He said, "Go ahead, cut me." Oh, dang, he went straight for the gut. Dang, staring at him? Jackpot. What's that? Final Flash? Yeah, I don't mind seeing it again. <laughs> it was dope. He's just laughing it off while his head is on fire. 
Oh, wow. All right. That's how he took that. Oh, he had to use his hockey to stop that, <laughs> wherever that was. Oh, dang, he melted the ground, G. Are we sheathing the sword? Okay, what's up? Oh, he's gonna do what I think he's doing? Oh, we getting facts on kings. Lunarian. Last survivor. They were known as gods. That's wild. Like your race is gods. Oh, he said go read a book. That was a massive stare down. Okay. Ooh. Yay. Okay. Or out. Yeah. Classic move. Ooh. I like that anime so much when people do that. <laughs> he took the full force of that. They ain't not even his clothes. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> this goofball. You hearing the Shamsen? Oh, again. My gains, yo. Watch out. Ooh. Ah. His side. Oh, Emma. Gone. His face. <laughs> he was like, I've never seen somebody struggle with a sword like that. Oh, we're going back to Logtown. And this is the um the current style, right? And he had two eyes. He's getting a history lesson again. Yo, I remember this. This is cool back in the day. Can you imagine if his arm got cut off? <laughs> he would have got that Shanks power up. Luck wins. Why are you having a Katetsu flashback like it's about to, like the sword's about to die? He said, are you going to die? But you're just going to hit him back up. Or just bounce off every rock on... <laughs> He's just bouncing off rocks. All his swords. <laughs> Queena. So, of course, he's going to eventually make that to a, a black blade, right? All of them. This Sunday like Kitetsu is not a black blade either. Oh, he's thinking about it now? Yo, how did this sword get there? Yeah, two swords from East Blue. Oh, that's how it ends? All right, big chunk of that episode was about Zoro versus King. Um, we see Zoro is not quite doing much damage to King. Um, speaking of that, Sanji, we cut to Sanji a little bit too, and he didn't seem to do much damage to Queen either. So uh, our two boys are trying to figure out how to beat these monsters. Um, with Zoro in particular, the king just let him have a free shot. He's like, yeah, whatever. You know, he had, he was thinking about a lot about his sword. So his swords are key. Of course, his swords are key because he's a swordsman. But something seems to be up with those. Uh, so I guess we got to watch out for that. Um, 
But yeah, this episode was a lot of Zoro fighting, and um, there's still more to, for that fight. Still more of the king and San or queen and Sanji, and then there's also Kaido and Luffy, of course, and then Kid Law and Big Mom. So we we got some fights left, and then of course, don't forget, don't forget, uh, Raizo and Fukurojuku. <laughs> they're 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 having the you know that's probably the last battle. That's what went with last. <laughs> uh, but yeah. Uh, Interesting episode. It's, it's leading us to think about certain things and reminding us about Zoro Swords. Um, I feel like we haven't, there's not, I mean, it's not a show, show about samurai and stuff, but we don't get a lot about, you know, the Supreme Swords. Well, not as much, I, sh I feel like, uh, unless it's Zoro involved, and then we get them. <laughs> and then we just get heaps of information. So it was good to see that. Uh, and a good reminder to, to keep in mind for, like, in the future as well. Um, but yeah, I'm curious to see how these fights are going to go. So until then.